Five animals that could defeat an alligator. Alligators are large reptiles that belong to the Crocodilia order. The two existing species of alligators and the many crocodile species found around the world are closely related, and people often confuse the two. A wide, rounded snout and black color identify an alligator. Only the upper teeth of an alligator are visible when its jaws are closed. Crocodiles and alligators rarely overlap in range, so another way to tell them apart is to know where you are. American alligators, which live across the southern US, only overlap with American crocodiles at the southern tip of Florida. Both males and females have an armored body with a muscular flat tail. The skin on their back is armored with embedded bony plates called osteoderms or scutes. The average adult size for a female is 8.2 feet, 2.6 meters, and the average size for a male is 11.2 feet, 3.4 meters. Exceptionally large males can reach a weight of nearly half a ton, or 1,000 pounds, 454 kilograms. Number 5. American Crocodile Despite the fact that American crocodiles and American alligators coexist relatively peacefully throughout their habitat in the Florida Everglades, southeastern USA, they can occasionally engage in dietary overlap, which results in intense competition and brutal fights. This fight between an American crocodile and an American alligator heavily depends upon the size, strength, and courage of our contestants, as well as upon whom is attacking first. Oftentimes, the crocs are bigger, stronger, and much more aggressive than the gators. Though there is only one confirmed case of a croc eating a sub-adult gator in the wild. Typically, crocodiles are more aggressive, which makes them more dangerous than alligators. In areas where they live together, American crocodiles sometimes force the alligators to leave their area. Number 4. Python both animals are daunting predators and have the strength and skills that make it possible for them to survive in the wild. In water, the alligator has the advantage. It's more used to it, is faster, and can dive down and bite the python. However, on land, the python has more chances. Unlike crocodiles, alligators walk with their belly off the ground, making it easier for the snake to constrict the gator. In this situation, the python attempts to constrict the alligator so it can devour it. Burmese pythons are the third largest snakes in the world and can grow to more than 20 feet in length, 6 meters. These powerful animals kill by striking and coiling their bodies around prey, essentially constricting them to suffocation. Despite being non-venomous, pythons are powerful constrictors. The size of a python is more significant than an alligator. Being a potent constrictor, the python can quickly suffocate the alligator and swallow it in no time. In an infamous case in 2005, a Burmese python in Florida's Everglades National Park was found burst open and dead with an American alligator sticking out of its gut. Number 3. Sharks Sharks are among the most dangerous creatures that live in the oceans. They have amazing senses and large bodies, as well as a viciousness that makes them successful predators. Even if their range overlaps due to different habitats, they will not meet. Anyway, a shark would defeat an alligator in a fight. Alligators are smaller, weaker, and less powerful than sharks. The fight would start with the shark sensing the alligator in the water with its powerful sense of smell. It would rush towards it, driving all of its weight into the alligator while landing a bone-breaking bite. The alligator can bite and thrash, possibly injuring the shark. The initial bite from a shark, which is almost guaranteed to land, will, however, cause so much damage to the alligator that it will be unable to fight back. The alligator won't be able to see where it's biting due to its overall poor vision and 
the salt water, but the shark will simply aim for a vital area on the alligator, clamping down on its head or limbs. There are few records of alligator remains found inside tiger shark stomachs. Number 2. Florida Panther The Florida Panther is so rare that I doubt anyone knows what they do or don't do. If they are similar to jaguars, the only other semi-aquatic large cat in the Americas, they may prey upon alligators whose size seems manageable. Usually, the cougar does not attack alligators because they are bigger than them. However, just as jaguars kill alligators in South America, there are cases of alligators killed by panthers. The largest crocodilian to fall prey to a Florida panther was an 8.85 feet, 2.7 meters American alligator. On 14th of March 2008, we discovered an alligator that was killed by a male panther. This record is the largest record reported to date. There has been another case with a 12-foot alligator, 3.6 meters, but this is not officially confirmed. Generally, panthers are not going to take a risk of going after an alligator that big very often. Of course, this depends on the experience of the panther. Number 1. Bear There are a lot of variables. Both bears and alligators have significant size variation, and this plays a significant role. Normally, an alligator will prefer to go for something smaller than a bear, and a bear will avoid the alligator. So this fight would only happen under unusual conditions, and those conditions will usually dictate the outcome. First of all, this fight will almost certainly never happen naturally. While both animals are present in a good portion of the American South, they would rarely be in proximity to each other and would most likely ignore or flee. Bears wouldn't enter still water as there would be nothing to eat there. The only way this fight happens is if an alligator happens to be trundling across some land and encounters a bear. In this case, the bear easily wins. Alligators are practically helpless on land and they're not used to fighting large, aggressive animals. Bears are. On land, I'd put my money on the bear. In water, the black bear might have a chance, but the alligator would probably win. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, farewell.